Uh, it's like, like waiting for tickets to a Who concert. People brought sleeping bags, beach chairs. Gamers endured everything. Hours long lines just to get their hands on the new Nintendo Switch. The hybrid console costs $299, but you can't get it. Sold out, everybody, at both major retailers, in stores, and online. The device has broken Nintendo records for sales during its first two days. First on Fox Business, Nintendo of America President and COO Reggie Fisame has come to play and discuss the Switch, which is something that people have not seen before. Never been done before, never been seen before. And again, the, the magic is you can have this wonderful big screen experience, and then when you take the system out of the dock, it's right here. Okay, so for you turn to play. it there like this so that we can see. So this is a system, right? So this is not the system that's playing link right, behind right. us, but this is the actual system. All of the machinery, Look all of way. the activity yeah. is uh, is right here. Okay. And this is what drives you know all that excitement that's happening. So out that's of the, the mobile part of it. Correct. And if you want to then switch to your own television, so then you dock it, right? right? You put it in the dock, and then as soon as it is in the dock, now it's projecting on your big screen TV. It's that simple. It's that simple, and it's seamless. It's seamless. Okay. Tell me about the game, because this Zelda game, which is on the screen, let's right. start playing it. Sure. We can show people what it is. And by the way, for those of you who don't know and aren't cool, that's Link on the screen. You know, so this that's Zelda Link. game, Isn't he cute? you know, I mean, just look how massive this game is, right? And any place that you see, you can get to. This is a game that the critics have seen and are giving it, you know, 48 of the critics have said this is a perfect game. And um, it's the highest rated game right now on Metacritic. And correct. those are the guys who, who do it. The Legend of Zelda. OK, but it's it's sold out here. And as we're watching and you can continue playing and showing us what it does. Let me just p push you on this because uh, supply has already been swamped by demand. How are you going to get ahead of that and start manufacturing more and, and catch up with the shortage? Well, so what we've said is that we are putting two million units into the global marketplace Give me that in its thing. first month. Yeah. <laughs> so you'll play while I answer. Two yeah. million units are out in the marketplace in the first month. We're continuing to aggressively replenish out into the marketplace. Yeah. This has never been done before. Link can climb. Oh, you can climb. So this is, this is how we're going to get in front of all of that demand, by putting more and more product oh. out into the marketplace, increasing our capacity, and um, and certainly we believe that this is a product with a tremendous runway in front of it. A tremendous runway. So why didn't you put out more games? You've got Zelda and the 1-2 Switch. And I'm thinking to myself, not only did you not launch this during the holiday season, but you definitely, look at this, boom, get out of my way. See, I'm pretty good. See, redheads can be vicious. Redheads can be very vicious. Um, why, why put it out in March and then on top of it only have just a few games here? Well, a couple of things. First. We believe in putting systems out when they're ready, and it was ready to go. We had strong third-party support lined up. What we've learned from, you know, I've launched five different systems with Nintendo, and what we've learned is it's not how you start, it's how you finish. Where and am I so, going, by the way? Poor Link. So, you know, <laughs> it's running in circles. One of the wonderful things about this game, it's got a built-in clock, so we've gone in today. It's now nighttime. Yeah. Now, one of the things oh, I'll yeah, tell you nighttime. is when you see uh, enemies at night, they're yeah. a lot more challenging. Be careful. You've did just did jumped just off. Kill him? Not quite yet. Um, yes, Ouch. you did. <laughs> How do I? Uh, oh, well, that didn't take long. So You can um, restart it there. The, um, the question you asked, so mm -hmm. why March? It was ready in March. We launched it in March. Mm -hmm. Why uh, the two games to begin with? Mm -hmm. We want to pace games throughout the entire first nine months. Right. We start with Zelda, 98 uh, Metacritic game. We go to a new Mario Kart game. When? We go April 28th. How much will it cost? 59.99 okay. MSRP. We go then to a new IP called ARMS, then uh, Splatoon 2, a follow-up to the mega hit. We've got a great pacing of content. Coming. Will you allow independent gamers and independent developers, like, for example, Mass Effect? They've got a game, a third-person shooter game of science fiction. They say they'll do platform with you. Will you work with them? Absolutely. And we already are. So, great example, Bethesda. 
they make fantastic content. They have a game called Skyrim. It's coming on Nintendo Switch. We're working with all of the major publishers out there, and they're bringing their best and brightest content to us. As we finish up, will this, because people left Nintendo for dead when the Wii U wasn't that popular. They were wrong, obviously. Absolutely. Will this outsell your best seller of all time? And that's the Wii. The, the Wii has sold over 100 million units, one of the best selling systems of all time. Will it beat the Wii? Who knows? It's beating the Wii right now after five days. We're on a tremendous curve. So that's our bet, and that's what we're looking to do. Reggie Fisame, thank you so much. And there it is. Look, the DS was always the biggest, 154 million, but this could be bigger than the Wii. Thank you so much. Thank you. And uh, Zelda thanks you as well. That's a, this is Zelda. I just introduced our viewers. Exactly. To Zelda and Link. Great to see you. Good Great luck. Great to see you. Thank you. Two hundred ninety-nine bucks. I'd say the consumer spending. Closing bell. We're twenty-seven minutes away. Dow Jones Industrials continuing to climb. Where's this going to end, you guys? We're up fifty-two points.